everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel Ray and today I am doing a sneak peek for Diamond Art Club. Thank you so much Diamond Art Club for sending this to me to share with everyone. This is coming out tomorrow on Saturday and this is Cat and Flowers Shinosari. Did I say it right? I'm really sorry. I don't have any French. <laughs> This is Nene Thomas's artwork. It's a square drill diamond painting and it's a 22 by 30 inch or a 55.8 by 76 centimeter diamond painting. Let's go ahead and have a look. I'm going to share with you what it looks like and all the diamonds and where the specialty diamonds go. I hope that you've had a wonderful week. What is your plan this weekend? Are you staying in diamond painting? Are you going to go out? what is the plan inside of the box we get the diamond painting the drills we get a toolkit and we get a sticker this little sticker i like to put those on the side of the box but if you have a diamond painting journal they work really well in there too inside the toolkit we have a bag of baggies we have two plates of heart-shaped wax a pen grip two multi-placers cover minder washi tape the drill tray with the stopper and we have a pen and tweezers because this is a square drill diamond painting kit you get tweezers as well as the pen if you're going for a round drill it does not include tweezers in the toolkit very very nice washi tape i like that one let's go ahead and look at the diamond painting take off the dust cover if you're new to Diamond Art Club, I do have a coupon down below if you want to save money on your first diamond painting kit. But unfortunately, if you have purchased from Diamond Art Club before, that code will not work. Um, this canvas material is so soft. It is a beautiful, fuzzy tarpaulin that Diamond Art Club is known for. It, they have a patent on it. Uh, this is the bag of diamonds. Look at all those beautiful pinks and purples. Just gorgeous. I can see some AB diamonds in there too. We'll look at that more closely here in a moment. We've got a thank you and a how to diamond paint. I have a playlist if you would like a visual for that. And I am making more videos for that playlist as well. And here we have the legend, also known as a walking legend. Uh, and this has all of the colors. This has all of the symbols and the DMC number. And so in this painting, we can see that we have 70. Sorry, I had to sneeze. We have 70 colors. Uh, we've got three fairy dust diamonds here. You can tell because they have Z. And then anything under 150 is an AB. So one through four right there, those are AB colors. Here is the original artwork. It is so pretty. This cat has two different color eyes. I believe that's called heterochromia. Ooh, I don't know if I have that correct. But beautiful um, vase flowers, these peonies, the lilies, just absolutely stunning and perfect for spring. There's a cat down the, down the lane that looks like this, but it's a short hair. <laughs> Very cute. All right, let's look at the canvas. I'm gonna roll this backwards so it lies flat for us. Now this has the new um, perforated cover sheet here. So this is a plastic, it's still a plastic coated sheet that covers the poured glue, but it has a perforation in it so that you can rip off the plastic and make sections yourself. And some people say that they really like it and some people say that they don't really particularly care for it. I haven't tried it myself yet, but I love sectioning my diamond painting and making nice crisp sections, so I'm excited to try it out. Now, uh, let's look at the whole thing. Ooh, that cat is so cute. Look at that. Oh my gosh, can you see? It's got David Bowie eyes. One is like a hazel and one is a gold color. And yes, that is in the original artwork. Then we have the flowers. These look like they'd be really fun to diamond paint because you've got 
like, you know, the outlines of each color are multiple drills, so it's not a lot of confetti there. And I love peonies. I love the shape of them. So this is just absolutely stunning in my eyes. And then we've got the beautiful muted background as well, which I believe, hopefully you can see it there. Just gorgeous. And sorry about the lighting situation. I'll just bring this up so that you can see the symbols. Hopefully you can see that there. I'm having trouble seeing my screen. Very pretty. They seem to be very visible. I have heard that there are some recently. I don't see it on this canvas, but do you know the pound sign, the hashtag? Um, recently, I've seen a couple of people say that they they aren't seeing the whole hashtag. I don't see the that symbol, the pound symbol being used on this canvas, so I can't show you, but everything looks really clear from here. I'm not having any issues. And all I can say is that if you do seem to be having an issue, try a light pad or adjusting your lighting a little bit just to make sure that you're getting the symbols. Because I know, I know that sometimes our eyes can play tricks with us, especially in different lighting situations. So we're going to look at the diamonds and, and see what the colors are, see the specialty drills, and then I'll take you on a tour and we'll look at where those go on the kit. Feel free to skip ahead if you don't want to watch this part. Some big bags. All right, so we've got 814. I hope that, can you see? It's it's very bright outside today. And look, I'm wearing my, my Easter cowl. <laughs> 814, 838, 550. 3371, 3371, I can talk today. 498, 3802, 3837, there's two bags of that beautiful purple. 315, 3727, 316, 645. Here's our first fairy dust diamond, Z778. So this one's a beautiful pink drill. And then on the top of it, what makes it fairy dust is that there's like a light glitter. Can you see that? It's a beautiful silver glitter color. It's so pretty. 801, 815, there's two bags. Another fairy dust. Here's a Z3072. This one also has silver on the top, and the base color is a really nice kind of gray cream. It's more on the greeny cream side, but it's not quite a mint or anything like that. Then we have our first AB diamond. This is 117, and I would call this like a top color, a uh, very light tan, almost pink. And it's got that, the reason they call it AB is because it stands for Aurora Borealis. It has this color shift iridescent coating on the top. Very pretty. 304 and 413 there. And then our next colors. 311, there's two bags, 3746, 938, 3781, 317, 646, 844, 3721, 936, 839, 580, and 3740. We've got 434, 452, 435, 223, 333. 3861, 791, 834, 818, 935, 647, 840. Here's another fairy dust, Z783. This one has a gold shimmer to it. So instead of being silver, it's kind of gold. And it is that really pretty kind of orangey brown color. I feel like that might be in the cat's coat. Then we have 796, another AB108, this frog green, very pretty. 3787, 630, 3834, 109, another AB. This one is a gray, light gray color with that AB coating. And 433. And our last strand here, we have another AB105. 
yet another tan color, very pretty. 939, 823, 310, 924, 340, 211, 3348, 797, 208, 614, no, 60, 14, sorry, 3011, 3857, 3854, 3810, 926, 3021, 158, and 155. Okay, so let's have a look and see. The uh, 3072 Fairy Dust Diamond, that was that light gray, and that's here in the mane and the coat of this kitty right here. I had a feeling it's also in the tips of the petals of this flower here and if I bring it down a little bit over on this flower right here as well very pretty we also have the gold one with the gold glitter on top that's here it's like the medium yellow color in this flower is there any down here? There's a little bit in the vase as well. And over here in the vase too. And then we have that other light pink fairy dust diamond, which is here in this bottom peony. It's a plus sign. It's also here in these little flowers right here. I think these are roses. And plus signs, they're here on the background like that and on the main peony as well, just, just on the edges there. Beautiful. All right, let's go to ABs. So, oh, and there's, sorry, that, that golden, that golden yellow fairy dust is also in the center of this peony. All right, number one is our first AB. And one is that brown that I was telling you about, and it is in the cat. So it's in the face of the cat in these brown areas right here. Uh, also along here. Very nice. So those areas are AB. The next AB is number two, and that's that frog green. The frog green, if I were an AB, it's here in the little glass topper of this vase. Is, yep, there's some in these leaves over here as well, these stems up here. Very pretty right here on the side, coming up the greenery, just to highlight those areas of the greenery here. Number three, is 109 and that is in these flowers the grays of these flowers on either side three there are there any more threes in the cat at all i don't think so the threes are just in the flowers which is nice because number four is another shade of this gray and it is in the cat so we've got fours all over here, actually. So this cat is going to be blinging. <laughs> I can't wait to see what this cat looks like. There's also fours here. Are there any fours up here? No. So fours just here on this flower right here and a lot of them in the cat. So that is our diamond painting. That is so pretty. I love Nene Thomas anyway. I'll make sure that I link all of her offerings from Diamond Art Club down below so you can check them out. But this is coming out tomorrow, so make sure that you set your alarm if this is something you're into. Let me know if this is something that you're considering to get tomorrow down in a comment. I'd love to know. And if you're not planning on buying anything, just let me know what you're working on this weekend. I, I'm super interested. Thank you all so much for watching this video. Thank you for giving me a thumbs up, subscribing if you'd like to see more diamond painting content, and I will see you all very soon in my next video. Take care everyone, bye!